She didn't hear what I said after that. Great, good. <laughs> What's up, girl? Hi guys, welcome back to my relationship vlog. Today's another Thursday and we're gonna be talking about friends with benefits. Okay. So I was actually approached by a girl that goes to my school and she was telling me about a situation that she's having that involves friends with benefits. And I was like, I really wanted to talk about something different today, but I don't I didn't really come up with anything, so I'm just gonna talk about that because you know, me and my friends talk about it all the time and one of the things I wanted to talk about eventually. So just we're gonna ask yourself a few questions. Having a ben having friend having a friend with benefits, is it really beneficial? Has it has anybody experienced like an actual friend with benefit relationship work? I'm gonna call this FWB because it's it takes too long to say the freaking word, so we're gonna say FWB. If you have, I would really think that you should put it down below because I want to know. Like I def now we're gonna get into it, and we're gonna call to we're gonna call this girl Fumi. So, so Fumi came to me and told me that she's been friends with um, this guy called um, what would I call him? Let's just say James. That she's been friends with this guy James, and James is like her best friend, like. They're like so close. Like she's been through a lot, and he's been there for her. Never been in a relationship before. She's never kissed anybody before. She never did anything before. Like the only guy that she has ever been close to has always been her best friend. Like that's the only person that she has known. And her best friend is an asshole. Like, but like he treats other people differently, and he doesn't respect other people. Other girls, like he, she's been, she's seen his relationships, and she feels like his relationships are very, you know, short. She just knew that this guy is my best friend, but you know, I would never like date him because of the way he treats people. And then, anyway, one day she said she was going for her friend's birthday, and she had met this guy. And was the, this was the first guy that she had ever like, you know, given any time of her day because she said that she you know wanted to find a boyfriend or whatever like she was tired of being single she wanted to experiment with kissing a guy and then um she said that when she kissed the guy she liked it she told her best friend james by the way she told her two best friends because they were there was a guy and the girl me and james were best friends and he had another best friend sandra the first kiss and he was in the party so she went back to tell her best friends. So Bumi, James, and Sandra were best friends and they were all close. So he then told her that why did she kiss a guy? She was like confused because, you know, he never questioned her like that. Like this was the first time that he has ever questioned her. And then she just kind of blew it off and acted like that never happened. But this guy that she said that she kissed in the in the club, she never saw him again. Like he never gave her her number and she never saw him again. But it was just a thing that happened. Basically, she was like, James' behavior towards her changed, and he started acting really different towards her. It was actually her friend's birthday, Sandra's birthday. It was her 21st birthday, and they all went out to eat and then, like dinner, and then they went to the club after. When we said that, you know, James came, and James was acting a little bit like more happy and normal and everything, so they were able to have fun. And like they drank and they party, they danced, they did everything. James kissed her. She was like so confused and she had slapped him because he kissed her. She was like, are you trying to destroy our friendship? And he's like, no. And he started confessing to her and telling her how much that he's always loved her. And that it was easier for him to be friends with her because he knew that she hadn't been with anyone. Okay, what I found weird about the story was that she said that she actually ended up liking him because I'm like I'm making this story way too long. She actually, they started having sex, and I, and that's really fast. Like, you know, he never ever 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 decided to say, okay, I want to make you my girlfriend. My friend. She said that they started messing around for two years, and you know sometimes she'd go on dates with other guys since she since she became more free now. She said sometimes she'd go on dates with other guys since they weren't dating and he would always be upset. But she didn't understand because he really said that he wasn't trying to date. Like he was being the typical friend that he has always been when she was friends with him, which was why she never ever thought about dating him. 
because he never believed in, he doesn't believe in a relationship. So he basically said that let's just do this. Let's let's just be friends. We're friends already, but let's just be friends with benefits. Like let's have sex. And because this girl doesn't have any experience with men, she doesn't even know. She doesn't know what she's doing. She doesn't know. She basically wants advice to know if having a friend with benefit will work and that she doesn't even know how she feels about him that she obviously knows she loves him but she doesn't know she loves him more as a boyfriend than as a friend she felt more secure doing it with him since he was her friend than to somebody else because of all the stories she's heard about heartbreaks and stuff like that this guy sees that he doesn't want to be in a relationship so therefore if you start to get any kind of feelings for him that's really bad we'll say that um, friends with benefits is good but definitely not with somebody who is your friend like somebody who's your best friend that's gonna destroy your whole friendship what I'm trying to say is that I don't believe that friends with benefits work I feel like somehow somehow as you guys are friends and you're hanging out and you're just having sex casually you're gonna feel that feeling the thing is that the way the way relationships work is very complicated it's very like Emotions are very up and down and jumpy jumpy so the vlog What I know is that I don't think it works Because it don't make no sense I, Like stop looking for a way to justify things that just don't work as a benefit it don't work you can't be in a Friendship with somebody and have sex with the person and say that they're your friend because when you see that person Having sex with somebody else, your heart will stop pounding. Hey, didum, 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 didum. Let me do something funny. I used to do this for my friends. I'm so, so, so silly. But when I was young, my stepmom used to do this thing for me and my sister. And she would be like, give me a heartbeat, dun dun. Give me a heartbeat, dun dun. Give me a sneeze, dun dun. Ah, give me a sneeze, dun dun. Ah, give me a cup. Yes, I'm very, 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 very crazy. Never know how much I love you. Please don't take my sunshine away. It doesn't work. I promise you, it doesn't work. And that's the end of my relationship vlog for this Thursday and if you guys have another topic for me to talk about let me know email me at chronicles of her diaries at gmail.com or kgjones at gmail.com anyway thank you guys for watching my vlog and hope to see you in my next vlog bye guys